Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Today, we're gonna do another run on Sanctuary, and we're gonna see if we can at least have some good RNG and try to make it back to that 70 billion, which has been eluding us for the longest time now. Uh, before we get into the rest of the video, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. It's free, your support's really appreciated, and don't forget to smash that like button, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so, first off, I'm pretty sure I made sure all the girls are ready to go. Let's just double check. And, looks good, looks good, looks good, okay. And we got a Diana's an important one here. Let me give her a little look over. Yep, looks good. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. And then I'm pretty sure Carnival Staff, Carnival Staff, right? So that they keep doing their stuff. Yes. And then this one, we're going to have Neutron Blades as always. We sure do. All right, guys. Remember, we get one shot of this. There's no redos. So let's uh, wish us luck. All right, last time we did this, the Diana kept getting stunned over and over again, which kind of hurt us on damage because she does the most damage on the team. So hopefully next time. Hmm, that's kind of rough that the Angelica is stunned. The good thing though, when the Angies go until they're active, they cannot be controlled by CC, so that's great. And is she stunned? It looks like it. We also have the control immunity node for this, the, you know, the three builders you get to pick. So we have extra 40% control immunity, but it just seems like the boss just always rips through that. Of course, if they are, she, the boss is petrified, we don't have to worry about anything, right? But RNG on the petrification has been really crappy. That was our damage on these. Uh... Okay, there we go. We just need the Diana to keep doing her thing to help pushing this damage up with these Angies. We also need to do dual blade attacks. We're not getting bad. It just seems like our damage is getting worse and worse every single time we do this. And our, our Izanami is stunned now. Great damage right there from the Angie. The thing about Izanami is that she has that... uh. Reduce the amount of rounds of control immunity by one, so that helps us out a lot on that aspect. Oh, you are you are just gonna die, Angie. Yeah, our damage is even worse than last time. <clears throat> and I'm pretty sure the boss hasn't changed at all. I just think we're getting some of the crappiest RNG ever. <clears throat> Tell you the truth. Like I said in the last video, <clears throat> we seem to be like, we went really high, and then we're on this downward trend, right? We just keep going down and down and down. And eventually, it's going to kick us back up. We'll do a little bit better. See, there we go. We get some multi attack I mean, it is 25% chance to get the extra active. So it is RNG based. It just seems that the RNG just been really bad. What are we on round 12? Mm, we might be able to get past 50, 50 billion at least. Maybe. If everybody stays alive and, the and she can petrify the boss. Which would probably be great if... Heal back up. 6 billion. There we go. That's the kind of hits we're looking for right there. Come on, get some actives off. Like, yeah, there you go. Great chance is kind of being low on us. Come on.
Oh, that big tw energy twice into that. It's going to be some extra damage off that Diana when she pops. Uh, if Diana can get two uh, actives off, we might be able to get to 70 billion. No, she's stunned, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, she's stunned. Well, we got some clutch at the end right there. We got 69 billion. Don't look at the top one, it doesn't count. So, if that Angie didn't, wouldn't die, we probably would have done better, but we know that she proc shields earlier because she got really low with the burn, dan um, the DOT burn on her, which sucks, but it happens. Um, probably could have done better, but the Diana got stunned right at the end. RIP RNG again. But hey, that's not bad, 69 billion. So, hey, could it get better in the future? Maybe. But it was a good run. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, like I always ask, how's your damage doing on Sanctuary? Love to hear about it. Uh, as far as this team, whenever Diana is in a rolls this week with Von Helsing, I think it is. Yes. So, um... I'm going to try double Diana, one Angelica team, and see how that works out. Might not be the best optimal thing, but we're going to try it anyways for shits and giggles, okay? Um, as soon as I get that built, though, I will let you know. We will do a video on it if I get the ability to have a good run with it. You have to remember that. So, with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, stay safe out there. It's Crazy World. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out, ladies and gentlemen. Bye.